Have you ever noticed how time seems to pass by so fast in this fast-paced world? But when we go out to travel to a new place, time seems to slow down. I guess that's because the mind is taken out of its ordinary routine and is taking in all of the new experiences. So while one hour in the office seems to pass by all too fast, when you're in a new place, one full hour of new experiences feels much longer. There are tons of research that have been done to find out the effects of travel on the human brain. They found out that when, when one travels, the mind becomes a much better problem solver, much more creative, much sharper and clearer. It's like the mind gets a reboot and begins looking at things from a different perspective. Beyond that, I believe this desire for new experiences in places outside of this dreary, polluted, traffic gridlock place most of us live and work in is a desire to find healing for our souls. It's a desire to reconnect with something deep in our hearts. However, travel gets spoiled by the mobile phones and cameras and the strong urge to take a selfie and to take that great shot of the landscape. We must resist that urge and be willing to just take the new experiences all in, to have all our senses open to all that new stimuli, to see the beauty of the new sights, listen to the music of people's language, smell the aroma and taste the local food, touch the different textures around, meet the local people, get to know them, learn about their lives, their passions, what they celebrate, what makes them alive? Do you know why we are so attracted to new places? Why do we have such a strong desire for travel, for exploring the unexplored? I think it's because as we travel, we discover God in the beauty of his creation. When we open our hearts to what creation is saying in ways that words can never express, we allow our hearts to celebrate the one who made all creation possible. And so, just like the psalmists of old, our hearts may sing out like this. Let the heavens be glad, and let the earth rejoice. Let the sea roar and all that fills it. Let the field exult and everything in it. Then shall all the trees of the forest sing for joy. Find time in your busy schedule to take a long vacation to a place closer to God's creation. Go to the beach. Hike up a mountain. Go spelunking in a cave. Find an unexplored island or waterfalls. Resist the temptation to take a selfie. Or at least not yet. Let all your senses just take in all of these experiences. Allow your heart to exult in the greatness and the beauty that you see before you. And thank God for the privilege of experiencing all that. As we travel and explore new experiences in God's creation, faith matters too.